Do you want to go to Europe? Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. We're Simon and Maddie. In this series, we'll be going to some of the most beautiful places in the world. How good is this? So join us on our six week adventure through Europe. Get ready to delve into the charm of Christmas markets, dance into the new year on the lively streets of Budapest, marvel at extraordinary cathedrals and historic castles. This looks like a real castle. Witness the world's most famous artworks and monuments, Tick one of the wonders of the world off our bucket list, embrace the magic of snow-capped mountains, and of course, indulge in the delicious food that Europe has to offer. This is so good. Yummy. This is a journey that you won't want to miss, so let the European exploration begin. In this series, we'll be including bloopers, so make sure you watch until the end. We're in Budapest, woohoo! So it's before check-in time. We have to find a place to leave our luggage somewhere. There's this app called Nanny Bags that you can just book luggage storage through that. So we book one that's about 10 minutes from the bottom of the place we're staying. So we get there now. Foggy morning in Budapest. Where's the sun? Don't know. Where are the clouds? Don't know. Is the sky even blue here? So we've just dropped our bags off and we saw this really big fancy building with this huge line in front of it and we were like, what is that? And so we looked it up and it is a cafe. So all those people there are lining up to go into a cafe. It's called the New York Cafe, Yeah. but it's an Italian style. Italian. Cafe. But we looked it up and it does look very fancy and cool. Yeah, so. it looks like a palace inside. Yeah. We are walking up to Buda Castle now. Mm -hmm. Very foggy. Yeah, very foggy. There it is. My house in Budapest, Mama. My treasure chest. Golden Grand Piano. My beautiful Castillo. You. Ooh, you. Ooh, I leave it all. Oh, for you. Ooh. From that song, can you tell where we are? Still can't see much. Whoa, blinded. Blinded by the light. There's Maria and yeah. Can't see her. I don't see the back of it. Mm-hmm. It's a nice back. Don't know if you can see this, but looks like that's a bridge there. And that's Maybe the river. Now that the sun's coming up, you can see a bit better. It's amazing how quick the fog lifts when the sun's up, isn't it? Mm -hmm. A lot of constructions happening at the Buddha Castle. Yeah. Winter is probably their off season, yeah. so that's when they can do all the work and prepare for the summer. the castle well, pretty pretty quiet today yeah but we are here first thing in the morning and also we're not inside any of the exhibitions you can't you can't really go in yet it's not 10 they all no. open at 10 o'clock okay, and maybe because this morning it was a foggy morning so people just, yeah, didn't come here maybe. if we haven't told you yet we will be in Budapest for New Year's Eve and New Year's Day yeah I wonder <laughs> how the um, Hungarian celebrates New Year's. Hmm. We are out 
outside Chai's church. Huge line, like. Mm -hmm. We're at the back of the line. Maddie waited here while got tickets. She barely moved. You were looking, I saw you walk and you were looking towards the like, yeah, I was looking like, no, towards still, the front and then she's still there at the back. I don't know, it's hard to say. Desperate cost us anyway. Do this mean we'll go? But I'd like to know that soon And this time a yellow full moon So we just got a skewer, which I think is That's what? That's a big skewer. Is it chicken or? I think it's chicken. Chicken and some potato. Just sitting outside the church. The church. Potato. Mmm, that is a bit of fat, so good. Good chicken. Really good chicken. Are you ready to battle the crowd? I'm never ready to battle the crowd. That's the crowd. Sometimes you want to raise your walls to a high point But you don't have to tell me anymore But I'd like to know that soon And it's time of yellow food. Finish up there the castle and the Matthias church Yeah And the fish, this bit is called the fisherman something We're walking back down from Gellert Hill and we're going to City Market Hall mm -hmm. now. Oh, the hill. It was a big walk, but it was fine. Yeah, you might get a nice view from up top. Mm -hmm. Nice and peaceful. You see the castle from the, up there. Mm -hmm. And it's um, great weather now, the fog's cleared, it's nice mm -hmm. and sunny. You can see everything. Yeah, it was really nice up there. If you don't know, Budapest is actually called Budapest. We just don't really say Budapest because we, I don't know, we feel a bit like we're faking it. Yes. If we do it like that. Yeah, it's separated by the river, Buda on one side and Pest on the other mm -hmm. side. And back in the day, there was a love story between the Prince of Buda and the Princess of Pest. They love each other, but they were separated by a, by a river. <laughs> and back then, Buda and Pest were separate. Mm -hmm. But now, obviously, they're combined yep. to be Budapest. Mm -hmm. We're on Liberty Bridge. Quite nice this bridge. Yeah, it looks like the Harbour Bridge. Mm, kind of. So this is the City Market Hall. It's giving me a bit of a Paddy's Market vibe. Try to steal his egg. I'm stealing. Do I? Do I? It's got good grip. You know what? There's like fruit, meat, butchers, souvenirs, yeah. a little bit of everything.
sauce. Hmm. And a big thing of water. Oh, we have a window, do a lounge room. I'll go oh. to the lounge room. Yeah. Hello. We got a fridge. Oh, yeah. We got milk. And then the rest of the room. Huh. We have a second level. Cool. So what's up there, our bed? Yes. I like this and look, you sit here. It's like, it's like we're outside of a restaurant. Mm hmm It's really nice. Oh, what's in here? Bathroom? Yeah. I like it. This is like the perfect height. Oh, my my head is just touching it. What about you? you? Got some room? I got no room. Go. Cool. Mm, very nice. After checking into our Airbnb, we have caught the metro out to see the Hungarian Parliament. And I didn't actually realize that this was it because I thought it was like another castle or something. <laughs> pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Like Australian Parliament House in Canberra doesn't look like this. It's like we look up like the attractions to see, like oh yeah, we're gonna see this castle and this cathedral and blah blah blah. Like we look up the places to go, but then we're walking to find those places, and then you see the, like this other huge building, and it's like what's that? And it's like oh, that's just something, you yeah, know? Like, like that one. Not even yeah, like what's like that? Behind me, I don't know what is that. It didn't come up in our research, but it's just a big fancy building. Time. The Budapest at night is beautiful. So nice. I wonder what tomorrow will be like. Mm, don't know, mate. New Year's Eve. Watch the video until the end. Yeah. <laughs> we could have just called it the Chain Bridge, not the Shenyi Chain Bridge. The Chenyi Chain Bridge. When we looked it up, that's what it's called. And then the sign just says Chain Bridge. It's New Year's Eve for us today, and we are exploring Pest. First stop will be the Chenyi Thermal Baths. Hopefully, we can get in within pre-book but it opens at 8 it's almost 9 surely no one wants to go in our thermal bath at 9 a.m. in the morning we'll you see do. I do <laughs> we are here it doesn't look like there's a line so I'm out here in the thermal pools by myself pretty steamy I'm gonna get in now oh, it's nice oh. wow this is nice So steamy. <laughs> I think this pool might be 28 degrees. Ready to get a bit wet. It's like a back massage. Alright, I'm going to try a different pool. And while I'm doing this, I wonder what Maddie's doing. Simon has gone into the thermal baths and you're not allowed to have like visitors so if you're not going in you can't be in there so I'm just walking around trying to find something to do I don't want to do too much I don't want to do anything that's too exciting that I have to like repeat with Simon anyway so not quite sure what I'm going to do I just walked around the side of the building um, and I can hear running water I can hear people swimming I look in here I can't actually see anything but yeah, it'd be through there and through that gate is where Simon will be. Oh, it's freezing when you get out. Oh, it's cold. 
Oh, Ooh, it's cold. But what a spot to have a hot pool. Look at this. Uh, if you can't tell, I was shaking the whole way here. Right, now let's go in. Oh, what? This one's less warm. 34 degrees? No way. Looks like this one is a spiral. How do I get into the spiral? Going in, going in to the circle. There's actually a little bit of current pushing you around. The water is actually push, pushing you forward. Okay, this one's definitely not warm enough for me. I'm going back to the other one. These are so much better. So there doesn't seem to be too many places around that I can go to. There's something kind of fancy looking behind me over there. But I don't want to go there in case that's something big. But yeah, now I think I'm just going to go for a walk and maybe find like somewhere inside to sit, a cafe or a shop or something. Because it's very cold out here. See what I can find. Um, is that a cafe over there? Let's go this way. big fancy hot chocolate with lots of cream that I don't like. So it turns out my hot chocolate was like literally a hot chocolate. Like it wasn't just melted chocolate. It was kind of creamy but it definitely didn't have milk in it. So I'm not quite sure what it was. Maybe kind of like a moussey thing. So I've come out now and hopefully Simon's almost done. Simon has just told me that he is done. So I'm going back to find him now and see how it was. There he is. How was it? So good. Yeah? So good. If you know me, you know I love a hot pool. Oh, so good. It's like you, you get the view of, of like historic buildings. It looks like a palace inside. When you go into the outdoor pool, you see all these nice buildings around you. But, and then there's also indoor pools as well. I went into the sauna. Oh, one of the sauna was so hot. When you couldn't breathe, I had to go out, <laughs> went out, I had to go out straight away. And then, and then I went into a Roma one. Hmm. Yeah, the aroma one was nice, give you a nice scent and then the mm. temperature was perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so when in there, feel like a new man. <laughs> Let's continue our day together. Yes. We're walking towards Hero Square. You know what's there? Heroes. Statue. Monument. Monument. Statues of heroes. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh, this, it's a lot busy now. This there one is huge. When I was here, there was like a quarter of these people here. Everyone's so good here. I know. Uh, I, was what? Watch, I was watching it before and no one had frames either. And there's no railings on the side to hold on to. No. These statues are huge. How far do you have to go? To get the whole thing. To take a photo of the whole thing. You see? Yeah. What is it? An eagle. You ever seen one? No. Nice photo. smile that makes the sun rise.
Another day, another castle. So this one is the Vajra Hunyad Castle. I'm not sure if that's how you say it at all. Oh, sun. Sun is out. Warm up my everything. Everyone's touching this thing, touching the pen, so I'm gonna touch it too. Yeah, no, mate. Don't know who that is. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Very impressive building. To me, that looks better than the Sydney Opera House. What do you reckon? Yeah, it's not. But the Sydney Opera House isn't famous because it looks beautiful. It's because it's so different. It's unique. Yeah. Really nice. Big mark at this one. It keeps going. outside of St. Stephen's Cathedral. Maddie's over there in line. This is the most I've moved in like 20 minutes. Probably been um, waiting for like, yeah, 20 minutes. Definitely the busiest. We haven't Might, had to shuffle like penguins nah. to get in any of them. Must be good on the inside. Wow. This looks like a palace. Mm. Wow. Do you reckon this one's the best one you've been to? Maybe. I don't know. I just remember them all. We've seen so many. I think this one's up there. Definitely. Definitely up there. Now we're going to the panoramic book out. More stairs. Looks like a big bomb you see in movies that's about to explode and all the heroes trying to save it. Very similar to when we went up to the um, Berlin Cathedral, but better view I think. So even though I hate the thought of leaving you, I hope you come to terms and have it in your heart to end it all, you better off alone, sincerely yours. Look at this, no line. What? All those tour groups from before. The tour groups just take them to a Christmas market for lunch and then straight after lunch they're coming in. Don't come here during lunch time. Oh. Woo! It's New Year's Eve. It is New Year's Eve. I'm not sure when the last time I'm not sure when the last time was that we updated you. But we went home after exploring for a bit, just relaxed and chilled. Now we've come back out. Yeah. Noise is there, we went. It's clearly party central. Here. Yeah, exactly. We're heading to the river for fireworks, like everybody else. Wow, it's been non-stop fireworks since 8pm. 
There's the castle, right there. Oh, oh, another one. I see it. I see it I'm on the back. I like the firework that goes. <laughs> I don't like the. <laughs> I don't like those. Oh, right that. 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 That was it. I don't know yeah. if you saw it, but I heard it. I feel like anyone here can just go to go to the side of the road, buy some fireworks, and start Shoot shooting out there. Yeah. Everywhere we look, there's fireworks going. Mm -hmm. In Australia, it's so regulated. Yeah. You need like special permit and like. But people, they even get those like little handheld ones. You lost a shoe? Wrong size. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to coming to the river banks for the fireworks. Barely anyone here. I see, so, more, I see more people on the street than here. Yeah. After some research, Budapest doesn't Ooh. actually have Budapest doesn't actually have like official fireworks like Sydney does. Like there's not like a corporation who like does like an official show. It's just people doing whatever. That makes it really hard to find out where to go. Well, the street where we were before seems like the place to be. Mm. Everyone's getting drunk. There's a DJ playing music. I guess we go back there. Go back there. the feeling looks exactly the same they got a statue of you now just get that sign oh recording hello everybody 